There are accusations tonight that a member of the Community Oversight Board interfered with an investigation. The complaint was dismissed yesterday, but it is just the latest chapter in a rocky relationship between police and the COB. New Channel 5's Eric Hilt gives us a look at the complaint and what comes next. An already frayed relationship between Metro Nashville Police and the newly established Community Oversight Board now hits another snag as the Fraternal Order of Police filed an ethics complaint against one of the board members. The three-page complaint stems from an alleged interaction at this East Nashville Mexican restaurant. It says that Officer Caitlin Earhart was responding to a call about a fight, and during that response, COB member Brenda Ross came up behind her and grabbed her shoulder, started asking questions about the call, and then told the sergeant that she was with the community oversight board and didn't like Earhart's demeanor. You know, we were absolutely shocked and astonished that something like this had happened. Um, this is completely outside of the scope of the community oversight board's authority. It's way outside of their lane. And uh, for them to walk up and grab a police officer and startle them from behind uh, is inappropriate. Yesterday, the Metro Ethics Board dismissed the complaint. We were disappointed to learn that the complaint had been dismissed. Ross told me she feels sorry for the officer and the complaint should have never been filed. The dismissal comes during a turbulent week for the COB. A few things really housekeeping that I On Monday, the board's executive director stepped down citing stress, resigning after months of clashes with Metro Police over records. Now both Ross and Smallwood say they hope the groups can move forward from the complaint and find a way to work together. I would like to think that we're all going to be professionals about this. In Nashville, Eric Hilt, News Channel 5.